every now and then someone enters the chat and is like, this game looks ugly. Well, it's a PS2 game. Or someone will say the voice acting's shit. Well, it's a PS2 game. Are you afraid? In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. Well, I'm alone there now. Special place waiting for you. This is their special place. Why does it look so shitty? Like, is it always foggy and like dull and David Lynchian? Okay, apparently that's a spoiler, so I won't go into it. All right, fair enough. This isn't so much a spoiler, but I have a question. The Silent Hill series is the thread that they all take place in the town of Silent Hill. Or is it now just like, is it the Silent Hill in your heart? Stop asking such important questions. Was the Silent Hill the, the friends we made along the way? Excuse me, I... <gasps> oh, I, I'm sorry. I, I no, was it's just... okay. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm kind of lost. Lost? Are you Laguna from yeah. Final Fantasy? Sorry. I'm looking for Silent Hill. Okay, uh, I'm I'm here. Uh, I'm gonna go into the flower shop and hi, doggy. Oh, hi, Tommy. Didn't see you come in. You're my favorite customer. Thanks a lot. Bye. Bloody fuck is that noise? Uh, there's someone in there with you. From necromorphs to fuckromorphs. I don't like it. Uh, no? What the fuck? Oh, no, 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 I don't like that. There was... a hole here, it's gone now. There was a hole here, it's gone now. Make us whole again, Isaac. Garbage. No use for that. Oh, hang on a minute, Jamie. There's always a use for garbage. Especially, especially here. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, that's the famous thing that I know of. Was I hitting it in the neck area or the or the box area? Yeah, yes. I bought you a new dress, Lisa. <laughs> Just a mannequin, but these clothes. Hmm. There's a trash chute. There's some kind of strange garbage stuck in the hole. No wonder you guys recommended this game. But yeah, I'm I'm definitely into the weird creatures and and their weird twitchy. Uh, never mind. Yep, that's an orgy. <laughs> you got someone in a fridge and someone puking. He was like this when I got here. <laughs> my uh, my name's James. James Sunderland. Um, Eddie. Eddie. <laughs> Who's that dead guy in the kitchen? I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill anybody. Friends with that red pyramid thing. <laughs> red pyramid thing. I don't know what you're talking about. What about you? I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. Eddie, be careful. James, I, I um. You be careful, too. <laughs> okay, well, that's a lot of puke noises for one day. That is the, the part of James's subconscious that he, he represents James's uh, regret over having uh, drank too much that one time at the party. 
and spilled his clamato juice on on um Miriam on on uh, Melinda what what whatever so i mean it's all really deep any how are you liking this game as an intro to silent hill i'll answer your question momentarily you're the same as me it's easier just to run <laughs> besides is what we deserve no i'm not like you you were afraid i i'm sorry her name's Mary. She's my wife. I, I'm sorry. It's okay. Anyway, she's dead. Oh. I don't know why I think she's here. She's dead? Don't worry. I'm not crazy. <laughs> At least... I don't think so. Hmm. Debatable. Uh, what about that? Will you hold it for me? Sure. No problem. If I kept it, I'm not sure what I might do. Like, <laughs> the acting is on a completely different level. Yeah, I mean, for anyone just joining, I it, it reminds me of, like, David Lynch. Um, I've been assured that this is all very intentional. Though someone in chat just did say something very interesting, a possible sequel to this game. Silent Hill, The Room. Chris R., what are you doing here on Silent Hill? <laughs> For your information. I am fine. Tommy, you're living in a room made of, like, human feces. Dried human feces. Ha ha ha. This is my psychological hell. I love her here. Silent Hill 4 is actually called The Room. I give up. I just, I, today is a very strange day for me. Very strange. Chat, can I show you something truly horrible? Don't eat the ass. Oh. Uh, nothing. I'll tell you later. Why is your head a pyramid? Jamie, aim at the- aim at the body, Jamie! James... Jamie Sunday Lundy. Oh! Alright, you return to your fucking trash water. I'll just deal with weird suspense and not abject horror from here on out. Oh, okay, I see what's happening. Colonel, I've managed to avoid dying. Holy shit. That is a person. Do I look like your girlfriend? No, my late wife. I can't believe it. You could be her twin. Your face, your voice, just your hair and clothes are different. Her name is Maria. Oh, come on. I don't look like a uh, ghost, do I? See? Feel how warm I am? You're really not married. Super David I Lynch. You, I'm Maria. I know this game is sacred to people. I know it's sacred. So hear me out. When I shit on it a little bit, you know, I, I'm mainly doing it because it's, it just makes me laugh a little bit. But I'm going to tear this game apart. You ready? What is she doing all alone out here on this boardwalk with fog and monsters? What kind of bullshit is that? Right? James, I want to ask you something. What if... What if you can't find Mary? What will you do? 
I haven't thought about that. It's such a simple piece of dialogue. Barely anything to it. And yet... I got a lot out of that. He's on this thing. He's gotta find Mary. That is his sole thing. So that's what he has to do. He, to the point where he hasn't even considered... Hasn't even considered that there might not be another way. A poor son of a bitch. I thought you said the cops were after you. No. I just ran because I was scared. <laughs> That's me. Just eating pizza. I don't know what the cops are doing. But if you did something Running from bad, cops. <laughs> why don't you just say you were sorry? Did you find a lady you are looking for? What's her name? Mary? The infamous pizza scene, huh? Eddie? Oh. Um, you're... James. We met in the apartment building. Are you alone here, Eddie? Um, no. Bye-bye. Wait! Come back! Eddie, let's go after her. Huh? Laura? But why? Laura Palmer. This town is full of monsters. How can you sit there and eat pizza? She said she was fine by herself. Forget you. Oh, that's so good. Which of the deadly sins is Eddie? Well, that should be obvious. He has lust, but only for pizza. He's lusty for that crusty. I'm so sorry. Part of the wallpaper is torn. I can see something drawn on the wall beneath. Those hands searching for something? Or are they just a sign of pain? Piece of paper on the bed. I was locked up inside the basement's basement. Uh, what? Can we have a lynchometer? For every time I compare this to a David Lynch thing? James! Mary? Oh, Maria. It's you. I thought you were... Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. Anyway? What do you mean, anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. Why didn't you try to save me? All you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You couldn't care less about me. I'm sorry, who are you? you? Yeah, you would expect things to be more, maybe not explained, but you know, traditionally games kind of give you a little bit more and then a little more, and then a little bit more, and you start unraveling things and understanding them as, as you go. So far in this game, I've only become progressively more confused. So... There's two of us now. Hi there, everybody! Thanks for tuning in! What? Excuse me? James Sunderland! A brother and sister were playing in the road when they were attacked and chopped into pieces with an axe. What was the name of the murderer who committed this vile act? One, Walter Sullivan. Two, Scott Fairbanks. Three, Eric Gage. Well then, everybody, thanks for tuning in. See you again sometime. Man, I don't know, um... What was that? Seriously. Where the fuck? The lynchometer is at a maximum. Yeah, my sense of direction is pretty bad, but it's also... It's the camera changing. It's the darkness. If you say tank controls one more time... I'm gonna pull this car over, and I'm gonna throw your Pee Wee Herman doll out the window. And if you say Hank Contrails, I'll know what you're talking about. Whoa! <laughs> Maria! Live!
James just keeps losing people that look like Mary. Time to go eat pizza with Eddie. Yeah, this game kind of makes me feel uneasy. Getting, like, the psychological dread of what might be going on here and James being so stuck in the sunken cost fallacy of what might not even be possible, which is 100% not possible, which is that Mary is still alive. It's it's bringing me to some, some not good places, but, you know, obviously that's the point, and that's good for what this game is. But, uh... Yeah, it's pretty fucked. There's a door at the bottom, the door is locked. Yeah, now things are just starting to not make any sense physically. Like, the physical dimension of this whole place. At least the other places had some... Like, I mean, it's getting worse, and I like it. I get why it's happening somewhat. But you could almost be, like, fooled into thinking that you were in a place that made sense in the hospital or the, the apartments. Can't tell how far the blackness stretches. Let's go down. Just keep jumping into the abyss, Jamie. That's the, that's that's the that's the ticket. Good lad, top lad. Books are scattled scattled <laughs> all over the floor. Chronicle of Agrippa. Manuscript of the Iron Rings. I don't know who Agrippa is other than Amnesia. I guess I shouldn't worry about these too much. Um, seems a little demonic in this- in this cell. I don't mind, um, I don't mind talking over the game a little bit, especially when I'm going through the, uh, outside. When I'm in, like, the streets and it's, like, really foggy. Probably a good time to have a- a little chat, but... In areas like this, I wanna... <sighs> that was an effective jump scare. I was about to make a comment on... Why would Jamie even knock? Like, who the fuck would be down here that he has to knock? Very polite. He's also ultra jacked. Anyone else wearing headphones? Because that is some good ASMR. What could this... What could this be used for? <laughs> Don't even want to think about it. It's the fucking Buster Sword. Is this where Pyramid Head lives? Pyramid Head is name-dropped by the Great Knife for the first time. Oh, that's when you officially learn that Pyramid Head is called Pyramid Head by that description? No, it's before that. Oh, okay. I thought that was... That sounded like good lore. What else would you call him? Triangle Boy? That is scary. I have a theory about Pyramid Head. It's a psychological thing, right? And it's a comment on the Pyramid Power craze from the 90s. Where everyone, and probably even before that, where people were like putting things in pyramids and wearing them on their head. We're good. You're alive! Maria, I thought that thing killed you. Are you hurt bad? Not at all, silly. That thing, it stabbed you. There was blood everywhere. Stabbed me? What do you mean? Just before. Don't you remember? James, honey, did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? You were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. Excuse me? How do you know about that? 
Aren't you Maria? It doesn't matter who I am. I'm here for you, James. See? I'm real. Don't you want to touch me? I... don't know. Come and get me. I can't do anything through these bars. Okay. Stay right there. I'll be there soon. James. James. James, what are you doing? Do you think James is thinking with his hog? His hog is dumb too? <laughs> James, why is your hog stupid? This poor bastard. Hogs are, are very powerful things and I, I... I don't- I don't recommend listening to them. Yeah, I do feel bad for James. I have empathy for the poor guy. He's... Obviously trapped in some kind of hell of his own creation. And when he- when he needs... When he needs Mary... He creates this fantasy of Maria. Or something. I don't fucking know. There's a lot of guilt... That I'm getting from the writing. If it's, I don't know if I'm imagining it, but it feels like there's this level of like, I don't know, I, I, I don't know what it is. I'm picking up on something here. There's a, there's a lot of, like he feels like he owes it to Marie, uh, Mary, um, and I, like, there's something going on here. I'm formulating some theories, but I don't know yet. Again, no idea if I'm going the right way. <laughs> But if I see enemies that I haven't killed, usually that's a good indicator. Oh, f fuck. Speaking of. Come on, Pyramid Head. Right, you won this first one. Yes, sir! Oh! It just slowed him down. Yeah, the slowest fight in video game history. So, chat, just, uh... Keep it together. If you can. <laughs> Fucking joking me? It is a table. It's a bed, not a table. The bed would make more sense. You know... As a metaphor. Are you okay? <laughs> Angela, relax. Don't order me around! I'm not trying to order you. So what do you want then? Oh, I see. You're trying to be nice to me, right? I know what you're up to. It's always the same. You're only after one thing. No, that's not true at all. You don't have to lie. Go ahead and say it. Or you could just force me. Beat me up like he, he always did. Ugh. You only care about yourself anyway. You disgusting pig. Ugh. You make me sick. You said your wife Mary was dead. Right? Yes. She was ill. Liar! I know about you. You didn't want her around anymore. You probably found someone else. <sighs> That's ridiculous. I never... Whew. Probably best not to read chat in moments like that. Yeah, I, I, I see the walls. I, I, yeah.
Yeah, I get it. Wow. Yeah, that's, yeah. This game, yeah. Maria? Maria? Maria, no! What happened to you? Why? Why? Isn't this what was expected? She shouldn't have been alive. James watched her die. There's a name inscribed on the tombstone, Walter Sullivan. Isn't that the murderer? The name on the tombstone is too scratched up to read. Miriam K. Traitor. Angela Orozco. Are these the people that Walter S James Sunderland? Um, Eddie Dombrowski. Excuse me, though? Oh, though that's where I have to go next, into James's uh, grave. So when I chat just said these are all the names of the Kickstarter backers. Okay, that's pretty funny. Eddie, what are you doing? Eddie, aren't you look like? Dombrowski? He always busted my balls. You fat, disgusting piece of shit. You make me sick! From now on, if anyone makes fun of me, I'll kill him! Just like that. Eddie, have you gone nuts? I knew it. You too! You're just like him, James! Hey, I didn't mean anything. Don't bother. I understand. You've been laughing at me all along, haven't you? Ever since we first met. I'll kill you, James! God. To a boss battle against Eddie? Point blank. Take turns shooting each other in the face. They're wearing pants. Don't you want to meet the new pyramid head? That's right. I'm the new pyramid head. <laughs> Eddie? Eddie? I... I killed a... a human being. Probably not the only one, huh, Jamie? A human being. Mary. Did you really die three years ago? It's pretty clear that James doesn't... Maybe Silent Hill fucks with you, or maybe he's dead already? I don't fucking know, but this dude... This dude... Needs to do a better job questioning himself how you totally wrecked that dude with your buster sword. Someone said that they had never seen 
anyone use the, the pyramid head blade like that before. Which... I'm sure someone has managed to pull that off. Did I scare you? Yeah, and it did. You did. You're here to find Mary, aren't you, James? Well, have you? No. Is that why you're here, too? If you know where she is, tell me. I wish I knew. But she said it in her letter. What letter? Wanna read it? My dearest Laura, I'm leaving this letter with Rachel to give you after I'm gone. I'm far away now, in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not staying, saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. And Laura, about James. I know you hate him because you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true he may be a little surly sometimes, but and he doesn't laugh much, but underneath he's really a sweet person. Laura, I... Lo... Love? You, like my very own daughter. If things had worked out differently, I was hoping to adopt you. Happy 8th eighth birthday, Laura. Your friend forever, Mary. Such an ugly five-letter word. How old are you? I turned eight last week. So, Mary couldn't have died three years ago. Could, could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Are you taping again? Come on. <sighs> I don't know why, but I just love it here. It's too bad we have to leave. Please promise you'll take me again, James. Uh, no, I don't like that. Uh, what are you doing, James? Who was filming when that was happening? I don't- I don't like this. James, what happened that day? So there you are, James. Did you get the letter? Did you find Mary? If not, let's get going already, okay? Mary's gone. She's dead. She... she died because she was sick? No. I killed her. Probably a good idea to tell a child all this, huh, James? James, where are you? I'm waiting. I'm waiting for you. Please come to me. Do you hate me? Is that why you won't come? James? That voice! But yeah, uh, I don't know. I guess while I'm doing this, I'm having, you know, I have the time to reflect on what's going on here and yeah it seems like Silent Hill is totally creepy and haunted and whoever comes here has to deal with their worst sins or the, their guilt I mean I picked up on some of it I picked up on some of the the guilt that James seemed to be exhibiting <laughs> that's a new word for you Thank you for saving me. Oh. But I wish Running the you gamut had. of emotions. Even Mama said it. I deserved what happened. No, Angela. That's wrong. No. Don't pity me. I'm not worth it. It's hot as hell in here. <laughs> For me, it's always like this. Oh, 
<laughs> oh man. Oh man. <laughs> oh boy. This door looks like it leads to Pyramid Head's abode. What what manner of pyramid friends do I have to find? Double pyramid friends. Man, they love killing Maria. I was weak. That's why I needed you. I needed someone to punish me for my sins. But that's all over now. I know the truth. Now it's time to end this. I don't know how effective this is, James. But I do have an idea. It's me getting fucking murdered is the, is the idea. Okay. T pose suicide. There really should be no other way for a pyramid head to die. I accept this. Mary? What do you want, James? I, uh, I brought you some flowers. Flowers? I don't want any damn flowers. Just go home already. Mary, what are you saying? Look, I'm disgusting. I don't deserve flowers. Between the disease and the drugs. I look like a monster. Well, what are you looking at? Get the hell out of here! Leave me alone already! No use to anyone. I'll be dead soon anyway. Maybe today. Maybe tomorrow. It'd be easier if they'd just kill me. But I guess the hospital is making a nice profit off me. Oh they want to keep me alive. Are you still here? I told you to go! Are you deaf? Don't come back! Video games are fun. Video games are fun. Make me want to die. Video games are fun. Mary? When will you ever stop making that mistake? Mary is dead. You killed her. Maria? It's you. But I don't need you anymore. I understand now. It's time to end this nightmare. No! I won't let you! You deserve to die too, James! I definitely, I definitely see what Cry of Fear was going for. Not nearly as effective as this game, though. Four hits. Gotta go. James. I told you that I wanted to die, James. I wanted the pain to end. That's why I did it, honey. I just couldn't watch you suffer. <sighs> no. That's not true. You also said you didn't want to die. The truth is, I hated you. I wanted you out of the way. 
I wanted my life back. Yeah. James, if that were true, then why do you look so sad? A fairly common feeling. Mary? A lot of guilt associated with stuff like this. James. In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. Every day I stare up at the cracks in the ceiling, and all I can think about is how unfair it all is. Yeah. I was so angry all the time, and I struck out at everyone I loved most. Especially you, James. You've given me so much, and I haven't been able to return a single thing. That's why I want you to live for yourself now. Do what's best for you, James. Yeah, that's, uh, that's not what I was expecting when I started playing Silent Hill 2. I guess it's almost a good ending for James. In the sense that... You know, he, he has to move on now, and he has Mary's blessing to move on. Is he ever going to be able to live with himself? Uh, it really, that, yeah, I mean, the story affected me. A lot of us have lost loved ones to some extent, or to some fucked up disease. It's easy to pretend and meme like everything's okay, and, and that's good because we want to be, like, we want to escape and be happy, but it, at the same time, we do have to face the harsh reality that this world does suck, and there's things like bone cancer that exist and, and other terrible things, and that's a fact that is not lost on me. So playing this game, the way it builds up to that and the way it hits you, yeah, it was pretty rough. It was pretty rough for me. I didn't like it. I mean, I love the game. I love what it was saying. I'm just, it just made me really sad. That's all. Anyway, here's the dog ending. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, that is very clearly the best ending. And James learned how to speak Japanese. Finally, dogs taught us how to laugh again. They spent a lot of effort shitposting in this game, huh? And that's how it ends? Really? That's how it ends?